Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghu here. In this class, we do some practice examples on HCF and LCM of decimal fractions. In our previous classes, we already discussed about what HCF and LCM means. Please watch those classes and come back here. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class, the last example is very, very important to understand. So first, HCF and LCM of decimal fractions. If the numbers are given like this, 0.63, 1.05, 2.1, 1, how we identify the LCM and HCF values? So the first point you have to do when the decimal fractions has been given, make the same number of decimal places. Means after dot, you have to make equal number of decimal places. So two places, two places, one place is there. Add one zero, nothing will happen. The value is not going to change so we we make them as equal number of decimal places 0 0.63 1.05 2.10 so remove the dot remove the dot if you remove the dot the values are without decimal places 63 105 and 210 now we have to identify the hcf of 63 105 210 is 21 lcm of 63 105 210 is 630 we are not uh, going to concentrate on how this hcf value and lcm value we already discussed a few examples in our previous classes. So 21 and 630. Now coming to the HCF of 0 0.63, 1.05, 2.10 is 21. So two decimal places. So that is, we call it as 0 0.21. LCM of 0 0.63, 1.05, 2.10 is 6.30. 630 value. Make two places, decimal places, 6.30. This is the LCM value. This is how we identify uh, the decimal places uh, HCF and LCM value. One more example for better understanding. Example 2, 51.3, 113.4, 121.5. Make equal number of decimal places. Uh, here, one decimal place, one decimal place, one decimal place. No need to change. Uh, remove the dot, 513, 1134, 1215. HCF of 513, 1134, 1215 is 27. HCF 51.3, 113.4, 121.5 is after one place, we have to place decimal value 2.7. So what's this HCF value means? HCF means highest common factor. It's a common factor for these three values. Means all the numbers should be divided by this number exactly. That is what a factor means. Let's check for a few of the examples for better understanding. 51.3 by 2.7, it's 19. Means it is going to divide exactly. 113. 0.4 divided by 2.7 which is 42 similarly if you check the remaining values they are also going to divide it exactly now coming to the third example last example arrange the fraction 17 by 18 31 by 36 43 by 45 59 by 60 in ascending order so the usual way what we go with is a find the fraction value find the fraction value find the fraction value find the fraction value we have to arrange them in ascending order but it is a lengthy lengthy way uh, there is a shortcut to do this using lcm that is the point you have to understand easy way is uh, you have to find the lcm of denominators lcm of denominators uh, lcm of 18 36 45 60 is 180 now we have to convert the denominators to the value of uh, 180 LCM value 17 by 18 is our first number which is 17 multiplied by 10 18 multiplied by 10 we have the denominator as 180 31 by 36 second number 31 multiplied by 5 36 multiplied by 5 we get 155 by 180 denominator is 180 which is the value of LCM 43 by 45 is converted into 172 by 180. 59 by 60 is converted into 177 by 180. Now arrange them in the ascending order. That's the ascending order which we needed for fractions. 155 by 180 less than 170 by 180 less than 172 by 180 less than 177 by 180. So this is the easy way to do the fractions and arrange them in ascending order. Hope you understand these examples. In our next class, we are going to do some more examples on HCF and LCM. If you have any questions regarding the concept, please post your questions in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you.